Vera is airing on ITV with Brenda Blethyn's DCI Stanhope discovering the body of a local council enforcement officer. Actress Blethyn has been at the show's helm for 12 years and she has no desire to retire any time soon. Express.co.uk has all you need to know about the actress and her eight siblings. Meet Brenda Blethyn's siblings. Actress Blethyn was born in Ramsgate in February 1946, to parents William Charles Bottle and Louisa Kathleen Bottle. She changed her surname when she married Alan James Blethyn back in 1964, and the pair were together until 1973. Blethyn has six brothers and two sisters, with her female siblings called Jeannie and Pam. Her brothers' names are Bernard, Brian, Martin, Terry, Ted and Bill. It seems none of her siblings have chosen the same TV career as her. Her mother was a housewife and former maid, who met William while working for the same household in Broadstairs, Kent. Blethyn is the youngest of the nine children born to the Roman Catholic couple, who did not marry until they'd already had eight children. When Brenda was born, her father was almost 52 and her mother was 41. She was 20 years junior to her eldest sibling. In her memoir entitled Mixed Fancies, Blethyn wrote, According to Dad, when he met Mum it was love at first sight and it wasn't long before he popped the question. Mum, however, although she felt the same way, said she needed a little more persuading. Quite a lot more persuading as it turned out. Even after the birth of their eighth child in 1943. As a child, she was first introduced to cinema by her parents, who took her there weekly. However, it was not until her first marriage ended that she pursued a professional career in acting. In a Meet the Author video after writing her memoir, she explained how her beginnings were quite humble. She said, I'm the youngest of nine children and we didn't have much money. But then suddenly to end up, you know, in Hollywood, the publishers seemed to think it was an extraordinary journey. I thought okay let's give this a go, a huge challenge, and I loved every minute of it. She said she shared all of her anecdotes with her brothers and they would give her plenty of ideas for stories to include. She added, my book is called Mixed Fancies and that relates to the joyful treat of having two shillings worth of mixed fancies, they were little tiny cakes. The cream horn was just delicious and we would fight over that one, we would all have a clout and would be sent to bed. 